The broad club cuttlefish is the second largest species of cuttlefish and the most common on coral reefs. It can adopt an infinite number of textures, colours and poses to camouflage itself, communicate and to hypnotise prey. As the name suggests, the crinoid cuttlefish tends to hang around feather stars, but this one is hiding amongst the branches of a decaying staghorn coral. This is an undescribed species known only from Indonesia. It can be recognised by the dark spots at the front of its lower arms. The dwarf or stumpy-spined cuttlefish is a tiny species that is usually only seen at night. Rather than swimming, it usually uses its lower arms to walk on and explore the seabed. It is often found in association with echinoderms, such as this sea urchin. Another species that walks on its arms is one of the real stars of Lembe, the flamboyant cuttlefish. When disturbed, it abandons its camouflage and the skin adopts spectacular shades of purple and yellow with waves of white radiating down the mantle. The colour changes are achieved by adjusting millions of pigmented cells in the skin called chromatophores. This is an example of aposomatic coloration, whereby a creature warns potential predators of its toxicity. Scientists have recently discovered that the flamboyant cuttlefish's muscle tissue contains a unique and highly potent toxin, proving that this display is no bluff. Cuttlefish's intelligence and unique powers compensate for their lack of a protective shell. They have the highest brain-to-body mass ratio of all invertebrates and researchers have shown them to possess a good memory and a high capacity for learning. Like other cuttlefishes, they possess special feeding tentacles which they use for snatching prey such as small shrimps or gobies. This tiny juvenile raises its median tentacles a common threat display amongst cuttlefishes. Octopuses are closely related to cuttlefishes and have similar characteristics and intelligence. Here at TK, this undescribed octopus has captured a crab and retreats to its burrow to enjoy the meal. This octopus is a near relative of the mimic octopus and wonderpus. It usually injects the crab with a paralysing saliva before using its parrot-like beak at the centre of its arms to excavate the meat from the crab. As the name suggests, the starry night octopus is a nocturnal species. This starry night octopus led me a dance across the reef, twisting, turning and contorting itself as it tried to escape my attention.
This flame scallop is a type of bivalve.